Hi, I'm Betsy Podlack. I want to thank Fred Holmes and the Frederick Holmes Gallery of Modern Contemporary Art for presenting my work in a solo show in their beautiful Seattle space. And I want to thank all of you for watching this video and for checking out my work at their gallery. I was asked to make this video to talk a little bit about my work and I'm going to use my photographer friend to help me. He's going to ask a couple questions. Hi guys. So let's talk about the two pieces behind you. Yeah, these are the last two um, to go to the gallery because I was still working on them. This is um, Diana, the Huntress, but sort of reimagined as more of an adult woman. This one came to me fully formed. Um, I started it when the protest started, and for some reason I walked into my studio in this image of standing in the water with my arms in that position where the sea turtle just came to me so I just painted it and um, I think I will understand I mean it has to do with nature and different things but I'll probably understand what it says and what it communicates as time goes by a little better um, so yeah okay go ahead <laughs> I know we're trying to time this right go ahead um, a lot to ask here but um uh, people wonder, A, if you uh, use yourself as a model in these things, and then, you know, um, you talked a little bit about the spiritual connection. Um, you said to me that you were both living in the moment in society, like you just talked about, and also at the same time reaching for something more eternal or outside of time having to do with our bodies being connected to nature, which is eternal, and not society, which is temporal. Um, do you want to elaborate yeah, on that? Yeah, yeah. I, I think that kind of, we're trying to sum up what why I paint the figure, um, especially the nude figure, um, as a woman, but also just as me personally. And I think one thing about the naked body is it does really connect to nature, really connects to the eternal. And society is, is, is changing all the time, and it's more in our heads, it's more intellectual. And I kind of believe in the body more in a certain way. But I also think when you're... I mean, painting is such a physical um, act, and 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 there's something about our bodies engaged in creating something that just just releases you from sort of a certain kind of um, thought with words, and it just sort of frees you. Your our bodies kind of free us, I think, and they also make us all equal. They, they connect to nature, and um, that is a big part of it. Um, and um, as a woman, I just feel like it's also a statement that, that women are just as erotic and, and spiritual and intellectual as men. I mean, there's something about that, and um, it's hard to answer this so fast, <laughs> but okay.